Volkswagen has launched a formidable electrification strategy and at its heart is an entire lineup of cars that ID. The first is the ID3, so named because Volkswagen says it's the company's third big idea. The ID3 is a compact hatchback that will be followed by the crossover ID4. The United States will get ID4 imported from Germany in 2021, but production will ship to Volkswagen plant in Tennessee in 2022. The ID3 is the first of the EVs and it likely provides a good preview of what the ID4 will be like as both share the new MEB platform. In Germany, the ID3 starting price is about 42,000 US dollar for the Pro Performance and 48,600 US dollar for the Pro S. But the less expensive versions are coming. As for the design, the ID3 is clean and contemporary, not cutesy or overdone, but quite industrial design like. It's not an intimidating or aggressive look but manages to appear serious and sporty. And the car makes the most of the electric platform with a spacious passenger cabin that offers nearly the interior space of a Volkswagen Passat even though it is only 167.8 inches long or about the length of a goal. As for the interior, there is a slim dashboard with a slim screen in front of the driver with basic information and a larger one in the vehicle center. Some versions feature a large head-up display that seems to project directional arrows overlaid in onto actual road. This option, however, is not fully functional yet and neither is Apple CarPlay and Android Auto functionality. Speaking of the powertrain, the RD3 is equipped with a motor mounted just ahead of the rear axle and a single-speed transmission. The only versions available at launch make 101 horsepower and 229 pound-feet of torque and a downgraded version of the same motor with 143 horsepower is coming soon. A battery with 58 kilowatt hour of usable energy is standard and a 77 kilowatt hour battery is optional. The larger battery offers considerably more range of course but its additional weight dampens acceleration. Fitted with the 58 kilowatt hour battery, the ID3 weighs a claimed 3,814 pounds and can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in roughly 7.2 seconds. Like a Tesla, the ID3 requires no turn of a key or push of a button before taking off, but for those who like to turn their cars on and off, there is a start stop button that causes a few lines in the instrument cluster to appear and disappear. It doesn't actually do anything aside from illuminating those lines. Either way, if you have the key and put your foot on the brake, you can put your car in gear and drive away. In short, fun to drive, agile, handsome, and impeccably built, it brings in good things for Volkswagen herd of coming EVs. I hope you could find something interesting when watching a video. Thanks again for watching.